Alright y'all, welcome back. Thanks for tuning in to James Way every Tuesday and Thursday. So you want to compete? Yes! Outstanding! Welcome to the world of competitive physiques. Physiques competing. Alright. So, what organization do you pick? I know it's extremely confusing. I went through this myself. I've been through this with clients. There's organizations, there's leagues out there. You gotta pick which one you want. There's OCB, USBF, IBB, NPC, WNBF, and a bunch of other ones. So, let me see if I can shed some light on this for you and give you some clarity here. All right, we're gonna start with the zero. There are wild, wild west leagues, organizations out there. They're not sanctioned, they're not regulated, none of them are, by the way. But, be careful with the Wild Wild West organizations. So I mentioned WNBF. They're mostly European organizations. They tried to come and they advertised the show in Maryland this year. This is a real world story here. My athlete contacted the promoter several times. Ghosted. I contacted the promoter several times. Ghosted. The show they had advertised with the date and the location never happened. Be careful with your ghost leagues, your wild, wild west leagues. I had a young man, Julian Dixon, in Texas compete. Teen division, he's 14 years old. I don't even remember the organization. I never heard of it. I can't remember it. But when he showed up, they squashed the teen division and made him compete against the grown men. A reputable organization will not do that. If you're the only teen, you just won the teen division. They're not going to say, oh, sorry, you're the only team. We squash your division. You're going to go against the grown men. So be very careful. Make sure it's a reputable organization. All right, so this is regional as well. We're located in Maryland, Delaware, Pennsylvania, Virginia. We're right in that corner there that hits them all. So around here, there's uh, two distinctive leagues here. USBF, United States Bodybuilding Federation. And OCB, Organized Competitive Bodybuilders. There's also the NPC and the IFPB. Biggest difference, biggest difference between these leagues. These are drug tested. These are not. If you're a natural athlete and you want an even playing field, here's your options. Both organizations, I believe, do a very good job testing their athletes. You're random tested. You're tested at the show. And they can poly you. And they can random, random drug test you as well. So out of these two, USBF, OCB. By the way, I started with USBF myself, my first two competitions. These are also great places to start. If you need to learn the ropes, your first show, you're not going to do better than these two. Everybody's friendly, from the athletes to the promoters. They want to help you. They want to see you do well. All right? In recent years, I'm going to have to give the edge to OCB. They're growing. They're getting bigger and bigger. Their venues are getting bigger. Their athletes are getting better. And they have the best trophies, by the way. If you're interested in trophies, OCB has the best trophies. They're pretty organized. USBF, uh, you know, it's kind of gone downhill, in my opinion, the last couple years, while OCB keeps rising to the occasion. So, in my opinion, if you're a natural athlete, OCB is your pinnacle. They do have a pro division. You can stay in this, turn pro, compete for money in the OCB. That's it. For the natural division, you natties out there, this is great. This is good stuff. All right, let's go to the other side. NPC and IPB. NPC. Believe me, there's plenty of natural people in the NPC. Just realize it's not an equal playing field if you are natural. Because there's going to be athletes out there on PEDs. Whatever they're taking, just realize you're going to, doesn't mean you can't beat them. Plenty of natural athletes dominate the NPC. <laughs> so don't think just because you're not natural, you shouldn't do the NPC, all right? Oh, let me back up. Let's go back over here. OCB. I've had plenty of athletes, plenty of athletes who think they're natural. And then go and look at the band list and say, oh no, there's an ingredient in my fat burner that I bought at GNC that's 100% legal, but it's on the band list. So, be very careful if you think you're natural, 
because you're taking a completely legal supplement, you better think again and check your band list. Each one has their band list posted. Most of them go on IOC, uh, International Olympic Committee band list. Most of them use the same band list. So, very important, check your fat burners. I don't know, I've had probably six people over the years think they could do a natural show, but they couldn't because they're taking a fat burner with a banned substance in it. That is legal, but it's banned by the IOC. All right, so back to NPC. NPC has local shows, another great place to start. Just realize it's a little bit more competitive than these leagues over here. They're not really as friendly. Your competition, they don't really want to help you, they want to beat you. As it should be, it's a sport, it's competitive. NPC is a little more competitive. Locally, if you win, you qualify to do a national show. National shows are extremely hard. You can get by and win a local show. Once you step the nationals, realize that's a whole nother level. Believe me, it is a level up. All right, so you go to nationals. You have to win at nationals to win your IFBB Pro card. This is the major leagues. This is as high as it gets. This is the Olympia, the Arnold Classic. All the big boys, all the major shows, all the money, all the big venues are IFBB. You have to earn your way to the IFBB, though. You're not going to get there unless you dominate locally and then win nationally. It's, it's very competitive. There's a, only a handful of IFBB pros that I know, and I am an IFBB pro, so believe me, it's rare. And it's tough to get there, but that's the pinnacle there. All right? So, if you're thinking about leagues, which one to choose, be very careful. Stay away from the wild, wild west. If you're a natty, check out the USBF, OCB, or NPC locally. I advise you to do them all. This is a great place to start, but if you come in here and you're dominating right off the bat, go ahead and step it up to NPC. My advice. If you don't want to, you want to stay natural, go pro and stay in the pro leagues there. All right? So I know this is very confusing. I hope this sheds some light. I went through this myself as a young man. Had to compete in a few shows before I actually got a handle on it and what the difference was between all the leagues and everything else. All right? So get out there and compete. If you want to compete, don't let anything stop you. Just go out, point a direction, and go. You will learn a lot. You will go do your first show, learn a whole bunch, and get better each time you do it. All right, y'all. Thanks for tuning in James Wave Tuesday and Thursday. 88 Fitness. Like and subscribe.